finale. Hopefully series finale, because I really don't want to play this ever again. <sighs> okay, guys. Tell me Previously if audio balance needs Minecraft assistance. Story mode. If these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer. That's not what I was expecting. See, this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It'd be nice if whoever made these left This is a monthly signs, donation incentive. Guidepost. You can call me Harper. Reminder to look at my Your donation incentives. Thank you. I look forward to studying. Oh, jeez. I tried to increase the audio on the game is fucking breaking. Aspects of your personality. Okay, Once how's you this? Have been made useful. We'll see about that. No. What is that? I what if you gave me the this link? This is the redstone heart. Beautiful. It can help you find your way home. Why didn't you say so before? The answers you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home. They're all right up those stairs. Adventure? Wow, that, that's like a lot of stairs. Off. And all revealed by the redstone heart. Amazing. Yeah, not bad, right? Not bad. Reminder, I overdosed on CBDs before going to my appointment and I was still nervous after you. Looks pretty ominous. There's some sort of giant monster up here, another evil computer. No, no, nothing like that, but you'll see. Come on. Ah, feels like just yesterday we were building this place. Still don't agree with some of the aesthetic choices. Very odd to be back. This is so cool. We've been exploring the old builder's world this whole time. It's amazing. Well, we were pretty proud of it and we were putting the place together. Kind of thought I'd never need to come back to tell you the truth. Oh, I'm sensing a story here. I... Guess you could say that. You don't sound hey, super Brad. happy about being back. What's up? Yeah, I think you'll figure it out once you meet the others. Need a good laugh. You mean we're going to meet more know. old builders? Still don't like it. Or Minecraft. Thing. Yep, but I gotta warn you, they're not as friendly as I am. I'm probably the uh nicest old builder. Uh huh. Old builder social politics. <gasps> My goodness. Yikes. If you're Yikes. the nicest old builder, these other ones must be really terrible. Hey, too mean. I'm trying to help here, all right? Well, you're going to give us the Atlas, and then we can go home, right? Kind of. The Atlas isn't exactly mine to give. It belongs to the other, uh, old builders. And, well, they might not want to give it up. Why do I get the feeling there's a lot you're not telling us? We'll make them a deal. Good instincts? Sure, we can figure Hell something yeah. out, make a deal with them, right? Oh yeah, it will be the greatest deal deals. in the history of deals. You'll see when you get there. Jesse, come here. Are you sure we can trust Harper? Look at all of our interactions with her so far. They haven't exactly been great, remember? No, I think she's definitely hiding something. But if we're going to get home, we need her help. Agreed. Don't worry, okay? We're gonna get that atlas and get home. I'm sorry to hear you feel that way, Jesse. Sorry. I just couldn't resist a good eavesdrop. I promise you both, I am trying to help. You just gotta go through there. A, a door? Like a regular door? Time to step through and find out. Ah! Very what? bright. I see a thing. Before you go in there, I have one more piece of advice. Don't die! What? <laughs> 
Oh no, we're owned. We're owned. By we, I mean they. I'm not involved. Seems as if some new oh, competitors no. have entered the match. My, isn't that special? I just, what in the world did Harper dump us into? Like some sort of crazy game. Really? You think this is a game? Jesse's right. Spleef. Gesundheit? No, it's a game. You try to knock the floor out from other people and make them fall. Ah, be like this! Oh. <laughs> Oh. My only decent teammate! Oops, did face me drop something? No bends, no bends. I'll get Ivor. Lucas, grab Petra quick. Thank you, Jesse. I couldn't have done it without you. No! Petra! Lucas! Woo! No, no, no! No! That's, no. That's impossible! Whoa, no way, dude! I got a double! No! I wonder if they're actually hey, dead or just game dead. This understanding, dude. What are you doing? Hey, using weapons is against the rules. Rules? Not cool, dude. So not cool. Slab is down. I repeat, slab is down. Stop the match. Not since the days of Tim have we seen such heated play. That's totally against the rules, right? Yeah. I didn't think we could throw TNT back at the gladiators. Nice one, brah. You are an incredibly horrible individual. You killed one of my best friends. Hey, I don't care about your compliments, and I'm definitely not your bra. Whoa. Hang on, dude. I am not in charge here, okay? It's them. Yes, we are the ones in charge here. And we have never had to stop a match. Ever. It definitely is strange, Mavia. What is going on here? I want an explanation. Immediately! This is going to require some reconfiguring of the stats, for sure. My friends are dead! You killed them! Wait, wait, wait. A and that's why you're ruining our games? Yeah, come on, jeez, how petty are you? Ugh. Lashing out just because your friends were eliminated. Kind of sore loser behavior, don't you think, sport? It is part of the games. Oh, you can't be serious! Okay, just tell me straight. What are these games that you keep talking about? I think if we all just calm down, I can explain. Your friends aren't dead. Wait, what? How? When people are eliminated in the games, they don't die. <laughs> That would be wasteful. <laughs> Obviously. They come back, and then we have them go work in the mines. Jesse! <clears throat> Your friends are alive and well. It's just a game. Let my friends go. Sorry, sport, but they were eliminated. <laughs> Them's the rules. It's called respawning, champ. We're not monsters. Uh, in our games, when people die, they reappear in one of our respawn zones. I hear it's still pretty painful, though. Well, Sport, now that you've come and interrupted our games, I'm sure our fans would love to know how you got here. Spill! Oh, why bother? They all end up in the mines. We're from another world. Yeah? You and everyone else here, Pipsqueak. You know what you are, champ? You're just a little gate crasher. And what do we do with gate crashers? Kill them and send them to the mines. Back off, muscles. 
Jesse's with me. Well, if it isn't Harper. I must say, this return is unexpected. You're telling me I'm here for Jesse. Oh, really? So tell me, champ, why do you think Harper brought you here? My bet's on Pet. That'd be pretty cute, right? We just want to get our friends and go home. Sorry, Chief, but this is your home now. Might as well get comfy. No way. We've been lost in your stupid portal hallway long enough. We're going home. Meaning you need my atlas. Very interesting. Well, that's all well and good, but I'm confused. Why would we give anything to someone like you? You weren't invited. And you interrupted Spleef. Because I have something you want. Oh? <laughs> Sounds familiar to us, Arhawk, but I don't know. Joking. Oh, jokes! Ha <laughs> ha! Hilarious! Nope. Not joking. I doubt you'd have anything that would interest us. Send them to the mines. They're cheaters. Let's make their lives miserable. For fun. What about this? Huh? <gasps> I present the redstone heart. Huh. Seems like only yesterday someone took off of that and vowed never to return with it. Oh, but I didn't bring it back. Jesse did. Thing's no toy, slugger. How about you just hand it over, huh? It could be, uh, pretty dangerous if you don't know how to use it. Nuh-uh, Hadrian. You're not getting one finger on this thing until you hand over my friend. I'm not a big fan of haggling, Jesse. Here's the way my offer works. You give me the heart, you and your friends go back down to those portals, I never look at your insignificant face again. Uh, without the atlas? But we need that to get home. So, not my problem. That's your idea of an offer? Seriously? That's terrible. Terrible? I'll tell you what's terrible. Hadrian, well, I do admit, the kid is not afraid of playing a little hardball. Even I think that's admirable. Well, you need the Atlas. And I need competitors. After your unexpected intrusion, I seem to be short a team. So how about this? You play in the games. If you win, the Atlas is yours to keep. It's a good deal, Jesse. Trust me. Everyone enjoys these games. It really does take a big person to admit when they've met their match, right, Hadrian? Yeah, that's right, Slugger. I'll play these games. Bring it on. Well, I guess we have a deal then. Gravel. All right then. I suppose we can carry forward with the official oh, event. Enough. Add it on your own time. Oh, but there's one other thing I want. If they lose. Harper has to go to the mines, too. Oh, gravel. Harper, want to be a friend and show our new competitors to where they'll be staying? Sure thing. This is so epic. Jesse, this was not part of the plan. Wrapped up in one of Hadrian's deals. Ugh! He's not one to let other people get the upper hand, you know. You lied to me, to all of us! Hey, hey, I didn't lie. Per se. I just didn't tell the whole truth. Tricky. Uh, I'm s I'm sorry, okay? I really am. Let me show you where the competitor village is. I would have, but the game wouldn't let me. We used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Well, here it is, the competitor village, sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. They're all in the games. Yep, at least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. 
Those poor souls <laughs> Backing are just that up, Agnes. waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Seems like you don't approve. I don't. Believe me, these people would Believe rather me. be here in the village than working in the mines. a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games. But it might take a while. I'm gonna go confer with Otto. We go way back, and well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Hold on a moment. We still haven't found Petra or Lucas. <sighs> I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines. Which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Nah, -uh, no way. They do not get to put my friends in their stupid minds. Ooh, it's been too long since I was part of a prison break. You've got a colorful backstory, don't you? You have no idea. Hadrian always was one for maximizing useful uh, productivity. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. We gotta get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll see if any of these other competitors have any promising leads. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat! Wait a minute, you're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab! And face meat doesn't like cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat air. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines! Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on face meat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there. Staring at face meat. Get my friends now. Face meat doesn't negotiate with meanies. Well, there is something you could do. Facemeat was busy slamming mad rabs at the gym and missed oh, lunchtime. God. You see? So Facemeat's hungry. Do I something like that. And Facemeat will think about getting your friends out. before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <laughs> it's so nice when new contestants are in the village. It's lovely having fresh meat for us gladiators to destroy. Have you happened to see my friends? You know, the ones that got eliminated in Spleef? No, but if I do, I will make them wish for elimination again. Yeesh, why is everyone so cranky around here? Could be that we're forced into an endless cycle of destruction. Just a guess, though. Would it be possible for me to uh, have some of that bread? It's for that guy over there. Seriously? I'm not falling for that. No bread until lunchtime. Get out of here before I make you into a meal. Anyone have any food I can borrow or will have? I guess I should ask around. Wow, hey, you are that crazy person in extreme spleef. Decent. Not as good as Tim, but decent. That's more than I can say for most. But not even a third of what Tim was. Who's Tim? Oh my gosh, where do I start? Okay, okay, Tim, legendary Tim, the Tim. First off, Tim is my hero. Oh jeez. Here's the secret. We're all just trying to be like Tim. He's perfect. Okay, I'll leave you to it then. Yikes. Oh, 
Whoa, it's you from Spleef. You were like amazing. I am now, and I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your prods upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> yeah, I am pretty upset. Totally get it, bra. I will never do that to one of your friends again because, man, I do not want to be on your bad side. I gotta say, you keep playing like that and you'll be like, Tim status. Tim, like one, like you could. People are like already talking about it. They're gonna like say stuff, compare you to Tim. That's right, I'm gonna win the games too. No doubt, no doubt. Okay, don't like tell anyone, but I would rather be on your team. Green team captain is like, she is so not chill. Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you, so if you ever need anything, you just come and ask, shall? No, I mean, seriously, I mean anything at all. Well, actually, do you have any extra food? Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, uh, quick before anybody sees us. Go ahead. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah. It'll grow back. Just, uh, leave the seeds, yeah? Where's the water? One. Planting as I go. Does anyone know where the water is? And that's another. Mm -hmm. Also, where's, like, the tilled mm -hmm. ground? <laughs> Hello? Sweet! And that should all grow back soon. Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Epic loafage? Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. At LCL, yeah, this game's this already had like 15 own. billion non-Minecraft things planks. in it. Hey, I remember a bunch of, like, wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by, like, punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no problem. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah? Where is the dojo? Is this the dojo? I just want a child. God damn it. Whom childin'? Where the fuck? Oh, shovel planet. Nice. What? Excuse me. Psh. Wow, rude. What about your pricks? <laughs> Oof. God, these guys are fags. Hey, that's Lucas's journal. You say something, Tiny? Because I'm trying to read here. That book you're reading? Hand it over. It doesn't belong to you. <laughs> wow! Ooh, that was so scary. I almost fell over. How am I doing? Hey, wait a minute. I am great. You're the pipsqueak that knocked me out of my tower. Yeah, and this belonged to that little blonde buddy of yours. <sighs> and you expect me to just hand it over? Cause I'm actually enjoying myself. 
There are some fascinating and thrilling tales in here. Yeah, hand it over, meathead. And Slab, the immovable! Get out of here before I use this book to punch your face in. Fine. I just want to get through one more chapter. What the fuck? Why did Jesse just give up? I didn't want to give up. Fuck this game. Oh, here's the dojo. It's right here. What the fuck? Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Hey, no hard feelings. Up. I didn't know what I'd gotten into. Let's just move past this. No. I will eliminate you next round and make you suffer. It'll be fun for me. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long, so you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Please, they don't seem so tough. Then you haven't been paying close enough attention. Or you're cocky. Either way, bad business. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. No, you don't understand. I have to win. Winning is the only way my friends and I can go home. <gasps> is that how it works? That's what we're all trying to do. Yeah, well... Good luck with getting home. What a bitch ass bitch. What a fucking goddamn bitch ass bitch. What? There. That should be enough for a table. I love to craft. That's fine crafting. Let's make some food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. At Saturn, play d -ball. Um, hello? Face me, got some bread for you. Bread, huh? Hmm. It's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mm, it's so warm. Get my friends out of there now. Hey, no need to yell. Though, uh, face meat is impressed. Jesse. Hello. Hey, Ivor. Am I alive? There's been something I've been wanting to say. It's about how you saved me back there in that game. I... I really appreciate it, Jesse. I... Ugh! I couldn't have done it without you is what I'm trying to say. Really not a fan of admitting that. Of course I saved you, Ivor. We're friends. Well, yes. And I suppose that is very lucky for you, isn't it? I'm glad you're in this with me, Ivor. Me too, friend. Here! Oh! Oh, response! Jesse, man, is it good to see you? You too, Lucas. Jesse! I really hope you've got our stuff because I'm not liking being armorless here. So, I guess that's a no on my journal, too. I'm working on that. It's tricky, though. <sighs> Give it to me straight. What did Harper get us into here? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. Now that you guys are out, we need to be careful. If Ivor and I don't win the next round, we're gonna all be sent back through that nether portal. No. No way. Hey! Jesse! I need to talk! <laughs> it's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just... 
<sighs> Stare at you while you mine. Yeah, it's kind of the worst. Lucas, we need the Atlas to get home. <sighs> I know. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. I guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Tim seems fantastic. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. Oh, I didn't think he'd come back. Hey, now! I said he would help. That's why we're here. Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real the backlight Tim. GBA really SP. interesting. As opposed to the the GBA SP without a backlight. I can feel change in the air. Whatever, as long as you don't cheat. Cheat? Oh, no, 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 no. That would never do. Not as long as I'm around. In fact, I'm going to make it my personal mission to make sure Hadrian plays by the book. You'll see. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I just hope this next event isn't too... deadly. Maybe you just have a PAL Game Boy chalk raisin and that one just sucks. Because PALs are for fags. Hello competitors and welcome to the next day of the games. And it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleet, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course, about our plucky newcomers. Hell, Parcel Bonds. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. Certainly fond of their own voices, those three. I can't wait to hear what today's event is. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these As punk As play D-ball? Yes, I can't say I'm terribly fond of them either. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? Oh, great, a run for my life. Just what I was hoping for. Bad knees, Beardo. Boom! Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here you are the newcomers sword throw. that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. I'm not gonna be in your twisted interview, Hadrian. Get out of my face. Oh, I'll get out of your face. But I'll be laughing at your face from my nice cushy box while I watch you burn. Oh, I promise you that. Burn! You little nothing. <gasps> Listen up, bucko. These are supposed to be games. These are supposed to be fun. So play along. I sincerely hope that we understand each other. I'm through talking, Hadrian. Let's just get this over with. Oh, you are just really pushing my buttons now. Watching you burn is going to be extra satisfying. Burn! <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but... Uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? You wishing me good luck? Come on, Em, that sounds pretty suspicious. Maybe we got off on the wrong foot earlier. I'm sorry. I was just mad about my old teammate you eliminated. 
Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and I thought, an enemy of my enemy is my friend. M wanting to work together. Hmm. I'm not surprised. We are very charming. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <laughs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. How can I trust you? You can trust me. Or you can take a slab to the face. <laughs> You got a point. Oh, that's not good. In the middle of. God damn it. Oh no, dude, rip Gaelic. Gaelic fucking garlic. Oh, and I accidentally loaded up my Xbox. This is, uh... This is very epic. Okay. The race is apart with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay I'll too. I'll give it a shot. We got a deal. Good. I won't let you down. Competitors! I feel like it might be to epic. Meet you at Gladiator Junction. I'm glad she'll be on our side. At whatever a Gladiator Junction is. I don't know about this, Jesse. Cardio isn't really my thing. If I were Hadrian, I'd be up to some suspicious activity. Come on, Ivor. I know you can unleash the fury out there. Show them what you got. You're right, Jesse. I'm going to show those old builders what Ivor is made of. Psst, Jesse. I just like wanted to say it's like an honor to be working together. And I'm glad that M like totally suggested that. We can do this. Uh yeah. I knew that you were cool from the moment we met. Competitors on your mark. Get set. Go! Oh no! Black, female, or both? Oh no. Excuse me? Competitors on your mark. What? Get set. Go. Hot, hot, hot. Okay, the game is glitched. The game is glitched. Competitors on your what mark. the fuck? Hello? Get set. Go! 
What the fuck? I'm just gonna mash Q and E and see what happens. I think the game is just broken. Like, no memes. I think this is over. <laughs> what the fuck? Move while I'm in the air? Why? They have never done any other area in the entire game where you have to move in the air. How was I supposed to know you're like supposed to? That's never been a feature before. Oh. Epic. Ah, oh, we did it. I love a good lava base. I love inventing new features with no like this is a little telling for even my taste. That that's like this a feature. Easy. That's what you think. Huh? Oh fuck. Out of the way, jumps. Oh my god, boy. Are you stupid? Got him. Not quite. Oh, out of the way! Out of the way! I hope so, Chuck. Okay, sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? My body. Dude, rip. Well, that answers that question. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Jesse, observe. for the fun part. I sure hope so. Come on, then. Glad she's on our side, Jesse. You're mine. I've been dreaming about this since three. Oh, yeah, Slab? Because you seem pretty outnumbered. Just means more fun for me. We'll see about that. Right, Em? Em? <laughs> I knew that was going to happen. Bye, squishy. Dude, rip Ivor. Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. That's math. Back to go Super Saiyan, let's go. Tired of you, slab. I was just thinking the same thing about you. Dude, this music's actually pretty epic. Is this almost Dude, over? I don't I know. I am like so close. I could do this. Sorry, Nell. I'm winning this thing. Hey! Whoa! 
Oh, oh, Jesse! Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked on! Whoa! Slacker! Hang on. Whoa! No! Oh, come on! How are we gonna get out of here? Oh, the water, little dude. I'm gonna ride that wave right back up to the top. Follow me. For you? Thanks for saving me. Yeah, I don't mention it. I was just being a nice individual. I'm often nice. This race is almost over, and we will soon have a winner. And I think I know who it might be. I am the winner of the lava race, the gladiator, formerly known as Emily. I trust you made good on our deal. I did. If that's true. Then why hasn't Jesse respond yet? Jesse. And there appears to be a confrontation on the field. Bet you didn't think you'd see me here, did you? This just went from bad to worse. So you sacrificed winning the race to save someone else. Good to know. And you? You were supposed to eliminate Jesse. Our deal's off. Deal? No, 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 please. You probably think I'm scum or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care. You have your deal, Jesse. If you win, you and your friends will just leave us anyway. My shot at going home just went up in smoke. So feel free to judge all you want. Hard to hurt me any more than Hadrian did just now. You really trusted Hadrian? That guy's like a creeper in a purple power suit. Hey, you try being stuck here as long as I have. Then you can talk. I'm out of here. That respawning was the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Ah! Ivor, what are you wearing? <gasps> it's what I've been wearing under my adventuring clothes. It breathes wonderfully. Uh-huh. Well, look who it is. You. Hadrian wants you. Hadrian? Why does he want to see me? You made him real mad. Come on, I don't have all day. I'm warning you, Jesse. Okay, if they want to see me, let's go. Uh, really? Well, that was unexpected. No. Just Jesse. Hadrian doesn't allow dirty respawns in the palace. Just try and be safe, Jesse. I don't trust them. Hmm. Hey, psst. I need to talk to you. Keep up. Come on. Come here. It'll be quick. Jesse, you gonna do what I say or not? Hey, Jesse. Yeah, over here. Give me one sec, I want to talk to him. You're gonna get me in trouble. Hurry up. Hey, what's up? Hi, Jesse, I'm Sebastian. Um, I know you're about to see the old builders, and I just wanted to say, please, just don't make them mad. Whatever they want you to do, just do it. It is way worse for us when they're mad. We're just happy you're here. I know, you're so busy. I, I'm just a minor. Of course, Sebastian. I'm always happy to help out. Then please keep helping us. It's so much nicer around here when they aren't mad. We sometimes get cake. I don't want to keep you, but some of the miners and I, well, we made you something. I know it's not much, but it's all we have. Wow, thank you. You didn't have to do this. Jesse, come on! Now we're going to be late and I'm going to get in trouble. Just the most not cool. Quit whining, Slab. It's super unbecoming. Oh, 
I am going to enjoy squishing you at some point. Wow, so this is how the old builders live. Totally epic, right? Oh my god, epic. Sometimes I just like to stand here and... Nah, I've seen stuff way more epic than this. Oh, really? Hm. I bet you're just making that up, snob. But why am I standing around? I, I gotta go find Hadrian. Thanks to you, we're late. Oh, and don't touch anything. Slab said don't touch anything. He never said don't look at everything. This looks like a craft area? What? Psst, hey Bat! Hey Batsy! Oops! I've never seen a quartz desk before. An area which you would craft? I'm gonna craft you in a second here. Tim's armor that now belongs to Jesse. So, I see you found Tim's armor. Gotta say, Jesse, I'm surprised that you try and steal that armor. Considering everyone is calling you the new Tim. Hello, Dan Fortuna. Doesn't seem like a very Tim thing to do, does it? Yes, I've heard the rumors that they're calling you that, and I can definitely see why. People love an underdog story. I'm not scared of you. Why should you be? I'm trying to give you what you want. You can look closer. Go ahead. I assume by now you've heard all about Tim. It has been Repeatedly. some time. Yeah, I guess so. Everyone loves him. And why shouldn't they? After all, he's Tim. They believe in him. Tim is an inspiration to them, even when he's not here. One could say he's an inspiration because he's not here. What do you mean? It's so much easier for a legend to stay nice and shiny when it's a fond memory. Easier to control it. I've been watching your legend grow, but I worry that with you still in the picture, it could get... messy. I've been starting to think it would be best if you made a quiet exit. You don't belong here. These games aren't for you. I don't really do quiet exits. Do you have any idea who you're talking to? I could ask the same of you. I know a lot more than you might think, Spardo. See, there's something you should know about the games. No one ever wins unless we want them to. Not even Tim. Let that sink in for a moment, eh? Ooh, I see the gears turning, sport. Have you figured it out yet? Tim gives them hope. He keeps them playing the games, but no one wins, ever. Which is why I think it'd be in your best interest to play along. But don't you miss your friends? Your treehouse? Wait, my treehouse? The Atlas can see where people are from, you know. So I had Mevia go check it out. Turns out you're pretty famous. I was impressed. Had to bring back some things you might be interested in. <laughs> uh, Axel! Olivia! Hey, Jesse! Jesse! Oh my gosh, I can't believe you're here. Yeah, this really scary lady showed up and knocked us out. Now we're in these smelly boxes. What's going on here? And that guy's voice is the worst. I can even hear it through the obsidian. Not gonna lie, guys, it's bad. We're in a world where everyone is forced to compete in these crazy games and will be prisoners forever if I don't win. Uh, that is bad. I'm so sorry you guys got roped into this. Yeah, that's not the best. Wait until I tell the others you're here. I've missed you guys so much. Wow, this is just, wow. Such a 
tapestry of human trauma and emotion. And we haven't even gotten to the best part. I save that for last. What? Oh, yes. Your best friend. Reuben. Sup? I've heard all about him. Your best friend. Your partner in crime. Oh, it was that guy from Endercon that was afraid of chickens. I told you, bro. Look, my name is Reuben, but the Reuben you're thinking of, he was like a little piggy. Though seriously, dude, big fat. So you used the Atlas to kidnap my friends and that other guy. Why? That other guy. Yeah, incentive, Jesse. Incentive. See, even if you win, and that's a mighty big if, they will be staying to work in the mines forever. Or until they get a shot at competing, which is still basically forever. No! Okay, so what's your deal? If you lose the next match and go work in my mines, then I'll let your friends go. All of them. You'll just have to stay behind in their place. I hear it's terrible in those mines. But aren't your friends worth it? If you're this scared of me, I must have a better shot of winning than you're letting on. Or maybe I'm just tired of a little pipsqueak interfering with my games. Okay, I had hoped that watching your sad reunion would be entertaining, but I'm done now. What do you say, sport? Your freedom for theirs, huh? Do you think you're worth more than all of them? Do you even really think you can... Do not them? engage in Bintory. No way, Hadrian. I don't make deals with cheaters. Fine. We'll play it your way. Which is to say, I will crush you. And you won't win anyway. Slab, get this garbage out of my office. Sure thing, boss. Come on, idiot. seen what Ivor is wearing? I said, <laughs> shut up! Hadrian has Axel and Olivia. What? what? He used the Atlas to snatch them from our world. No. Are they okay? Other than Hadrian having them trapped in obsidian prisons. But he offered me a deal. He said he'll send you all home if I lose and go to the mines in your place. <gasps> I didn't take the deal. Oh, guess that was probably the right move. Probably? <coughs> what, you thought that deal sounded good? I don't trust Hadrian. No way was I going to take any shady deal from him. You're right. You're probably right. <sighs> Jesse was smart. Hadrian never would have kept that deal. Even if you did volunteer to throw the game, he'd just send you all to the mines anyway. Probably, while claiming that was the original deal. So who's supposed to help us then? Hadrian and Mevia are both clearly the worst. But what about the third guy? Otto? How could he help? He's always stayed out of the more lever-pulling sides of the games. Well, he seems nice. He's the least interested in torturing people, at any rate. Huh. A good observation. He always was the most level-headed of those three. If you won, I know he would definitely make sure you got that atlas. That was the original deal. And he's an honorable man. Harper, what about all the people that are trapped here against their will? I can win the Atlas, but I'm gonna need you to get them out. You can count on me, Jesse. I'll make sure everyone is out of the mines before the next game is over. Wait, wait, wait. You really think you can free everyone in this place and win the games? Yeah. I love yeah, the games. That last part, do you really think you can just beat all the other teams by yourself? <laughs> that is a pretty tall order. Even for you, Jesse. Oh, it's impossible is what it is. The old builders expect us all to fight each other. I don't intend to give them the satisfaction. You're what? Gonna convince everyone to work together? Oh, yeah. Whoa. Looks like we've got a little bit of an audience here. I think that's your cue to do your thing. Tomorrow.
tomorrow we have to stand up to the old builders together. Um, actually, I think you mean the gladiators. They're the ones that keep kicking our butts in the games. Uh, actually, actually, the gladiators work for the old builders and they never want us to be able to win. Hadrian keeps twisting and changing the rules. I say it's our time to change the rules on them. What's the point? Hadrian will still have all the power. There's no way he's gonna let us just take that from him. He'll just make up some new rule. It's useless. Hadrian's not fully in control. Winning is possible, Em. Don't you want to win? I do, more than anything, but nobody beats Hadrian at his own games. Nobody. Hey, Tim did! That's the only thing keeping me going in here. Actually, Tim's not real. That's... No way. Of course Tim's real. Look at the banners. Are you sure? Yeah, Hadrian told me. I knew it. All of that stuff about him seems so implausible. So wait. Tim's oh, hey, Freak. Up. They just invented him. What a highly elaborate fabrication. Of course he is. It's all a part of how the old builders keep their control over everyone. That's awful. Seriously. But we can beat them. The old builders already controlled everything else. Of course they control the games. Why should I even try anymore? Sitting in their stupid tower, pulling all the levers. Hey, but the old builders don't know that we know. We have surprise on our side. Surprise, awesome. That'll be a ton of help when a gladiator's running at me with an enchanted sword. Oh no, uh, I that mean, freak. like, your plan to take down the old builders sounds cool and all, but, um, those gladiators are, like, super tough. <laughs> like, max level scariness, okay? Boo! Yeah, but so are we, you guys. Sure, their fists are huge and their weapons are really scary, but we've all got fists and stuff, too! Uh, where's Jesse going with this? If we combine all of our fists and stuff... We're going to be like ten times as tough as the gladiators. Oh, I get it now. Okay, now just bring it home, Jesse. You can do it! Doing awesome. We can do this! We don't need Tim because we are Tim! Yeah! Not real? You, you, you I can't believe it! Yeah. it. Look, it was a nice speech. But strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. Strength comes from believing in yourself, Em. Sounds like a bunch of nonsense, Jesse. Sorry. Man, some crowd. Think they got through to him? Wait, so who are we fighting then? <sighs> Reaction definitely seemed mixed. We're, we're doomed. doomed. I don't know how we're gonna pull this off. What? Of course we're gonna pull this off. You're... Jesse! Yeah, we can still do this. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. Ah. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today, kicking off another wonderful day of... The game! That's right, Adrian. And not just any day, but the final day of the game! Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? The it's walls! The walls! So, scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will judge you for it. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Maybe. For those unfamiliar with the walls, you want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come yeah. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that going to be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Whatever, I'll make it work. I'm that awesome. Oh, can't wait. Once the walls are down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end? 
Bavia. No, it is not Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat... Uh, gladiators! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get the Hello, gathering Eugene. materials, because that clock is ticking! Too dark. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Oh, choices are funny, aren't they, Mevia? What do you mean, Hadrian? Some choices take you places. Others... Nope, just dirt. Nothing but Come dirt on. and gravel in your section. Ah. I'm uh, guessing that's the eponymous true, wall. That's worse than dirt. Yep, just dirt. If I didn't convince people to join up with that speech, I'm gonna need something to work with. I don't know what I can make with this. <clears throat> can I make anything? At least they gave me a crafting table. Now, if only I actually had anything to craft with. Oops. Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mevia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down. Uh, this should be interesting. There. Competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. Jesse! Go! Jess! Hey! hey. <laughs> Hang on now, we em got movement. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jesse, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. You seem pretty sure you're about to kill me. Are you with us or not? Oh, ye of little faith. Jesse isn't even trying to defend himself. Here it comes. The finishing blow. What? <gasps> Figured I'd try believing in myself for once and take a chance. It appears Emily has opted to Wow, not am I glad that this is how this went down, down because uh, let me tell you, all I had was dirt and gravel. Gross. Could still come in handy though. What is Em doing? Why is she doing that? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah. Why aren't you all killing each other? Tja, man, I can totally see why you'd be confused. Aren't you tired of letting the old builders use you like this? Like, uh, like awesome people? No, like little pieces in their games, doing whatever they say. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them. They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. Christ. And it appears that the gladiators are being idiots right now. Idiots! What they should be doing is eliminated! Hey, Hadrian, shut your cake hole! Oh, imbeciles! Lab? Lab! What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure that the slaughter will commence soon! Right? You're all such strong, amazing fighters. You could fight the old builders. Defeat them! No way! I am very strong, but not strong enough for that. <laughs> yep. That is some straight crazy talk. Not going with them, Swab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate them. That's inconsiderate. Wow, Swab, I'm so proud of... Let me finish. 
you made me late when I was just trying to do my job, and that was real inconsiderate too. And then you really rubbed it in my face, reminding me I couldn't kill you. Hmm. Even though I really wanted to at the time. I think I need some time to be my own boss. I think it's time for us to finish this together! It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together. Right behind you, fearless leader. That won't happen. It can't happen. No, no! And they've done it. The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the Builder Game Bylaws, means they are all the <laughs> Which I'm sure my colleague means to say, we are going to find some way to disqualify them. No, we are not. They all win. Uh, no! Levia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. So help me, none of you will leave this place until you eliminate each other. Not happening. Oh, don't even get me started with you, Emily. I don't know, Hadrian. I heard Mevia explaining the rules. She explicitly said that whoever steps onto the winner's platform would be declared the winner. And here I am. It's over. No, no, no. Jesse's got a point. This isn't up to you. We control the games. We decide their outcome. Mevia. Shut up, Otto. This runt needs to pay for ruining our fun! So you admit the games are rigged, then? <laughs> sure! Okay, sure, fine, whatever. Maybe, yeah. Jesse won these games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse. With the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud to pay the What are you doing? Now it's been fun, really. But I think it's about time we end this. Whoa, this is majorly bogus, dudes. Surrender the Redstone Heart. Now. Now. Because, uh, I will trap you here. Forever. If you want it, come and get it. Your wish is my command, buckaroo. Oh, this is useless. Well, well. Just when you... Em, come back! Now that you've lost your oversized friend, you really don't stand a chance. Run away, little Emily. You're gonna need all the help you can get, Jesse. Time to take what is mine. I'll admit you're quick sport, but not quick enough for my axe! No! Oh, what the? Don't forget my what axe, the? Adrian! No. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta admit, kid, you've shown you got skills, but you're still no we'll match. We'll see about that! I got this, Adrian! <laughs> Had enough, Hadrian? Wait, wait! You're right! This has gone too far! It was just supposed to be a game! You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you... forgive me? <laughs> <gasps> this game... is... No! Oh! And that's our game, sports fans! The Redstone Heart has been returned to its proper owners! <laughs> I... I lost. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so! It's us! Yeah! I'm so happy to see you guys! You said you believed in me, Jesse! Figured I'd return the favor and believe in everyone else! You know, cuz I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. Oh, I knew you'd be back. Thanks for not doubting me. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped 
ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, suspenders. Over here. Tim's armor. Belongs to you now. Time to kick some old builder butt. Now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Ooh, yeah, nice choice. Not bad. Sweet. Payback ah, time. Eliminate! Now what should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hadrian! Mevia! This game just went into overtime. Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor! I'm gonna make you beg me for a deal. Seems unlikely. We don't beg sport. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy crushing you. Yeah. <laughs> Why not just dig no, down? No, it can't be! You may be a give up! <laughs> Got him! Wow, her inventory was huge. Mavia, come on! What kind of rookie move was that? For now, Bucko. Hey, Hadrian! Huh? Over here! You mess with one member of the Order of the Stone. You mess with all Go, of Jesse. us. Go, Jesse! I believe Time in you! Time to shut you up! You think this is going to help? You're deluded! Jesse, let's talk about this. Hmm, is that begging? Does that sound like begging to you, Petra? It sure does, Jesse. Told you. Shut up! Just shut up! Alia, shut up! I see you don't like having a live audience, Adrian. Jesse, remember Splee! Got it. Now, Mevia, we have to get out of here. Come on! Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> it's going not the best, and you're not going anywhere. Yeah. Face me wants to discuss his benefits plan. Oh, hang on, hang on! What? Jesse, you did it! Again. Feels like I say that a lot. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. You have truly shown my friends and I the error of our ways. I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Man, do you need some new friends, you know that? Yes, I have come to that same conclusion, and I am working on it. I also know that the Atlas is not mine to keep. You have fairly defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate. And with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? 
Remember, we called it Which Would You Rather Fight? And that's when I yanked Pama's redstone heart right out. And the whole thing shut down. Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Oh, hey, Chuck Bye, Racer. Jesse. Goodbye. Thank you. That all of them? Everyone that wants to go home, anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself, but a good challenge. You promise they'll stay fun this time, right? Oh, yes. I don't intend to let the games get corrupted like they did before. I'm bummed my journal never showed up. Had a lot of good stuff in there. Yeah, I'm sorry, Lucas. Well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. You get to leave and go on more adventures. Do I really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it. Well, if you want, you can come with us. Oh, really? Like, really? Yeah, we could always use another awesome person. <laughs> well, you're pretty awesome. Ah, oh, Jesse! That's Fucking wonderful. no. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> God damn it. Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello. What you doing? I was just observing Harper. All by herself. Oh, there. boy. She seems lonely. Come on. Hey, Harper. Oh, hey, Jesse, Ivor. I was just watching folks head on home. Things really worked out, huh? Well, I guess this is goodbye. I'm gonna head on back to Crown Mesa and see how the Post Palma construction is going. Just hope they'll take me back. It's not my real home, but it's the closest thing I've had for... Just try not to do anything stupid, okay? You don't want to make it worse. Oh, I agree with you there. I've realized my instincts aren't always the best. Hopefully, I can help people in a way that actually helps them this time. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Getting over the I was a bad guy hump can be awkward, but hopefully soon they'll invite you right back into their lives. Right, Jesse? You are a strange, strange man, Ivor. But you know something? You're okay. Take care of each other, all right? And I'll see you around. Bye, Harper. Yes, goodbye. Come on. You're amazing. Reminder, we need to worry about so, the pig. How do we get home now? Well, the Atlas belongs to Jesse now. Deal's a deal and all that. Good question, LCL. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the way. Why don't you just go ahead and open it? Okay, book. Take us home. Whoa! Spectacular! Incredible! Wow. Nice. There it is. Home. I assume M told you that she's coming with? Yeah, she's already promised to show me that awesome spin move. It's not so great. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. Yeah! Home, here we come.
Jesse, look! Can you believe it? We made it, we're whole! After all that time, all those portals, we're home! I know, I can't believe it either. After all that traveling we were doing, I was starting to wonder if we'd ever get home. Ah, <sighs> it is good to be back. I'm just so glad we're all back together. That atlas is so cool. I'm glad Otto let you keep it. Fabulous, yes! And that's not all we got. Seriously? What else did you get? Yeah, show him, Jesse. Um... Hell yeah. The crown of the Eversource. The magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! The Enchanted Flint and Steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. The Mask of Cassie Rose, AKA the White Pumpkin. Oh man, that's even creepier looking than I imagined. Pama's Redstone Heart. I know that Pama was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. The Portal Atlas. I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. Ha! Ah, I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. <clears throat> Sorry. I can't believe you got to do all those incredible things. Makes sense, though. You were gone a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements we've been making to town. Hang on. What is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, flint and steel are missing, too. And where's Ivor? He must be headed for the portal network. Is that bad? What should we do? I mean, I guess he mostly knows what he's doing. Come on, guys, we have to catch up with him. <laughs> God damn it, Chuck Raisin. Dude, I love being a contrarian. God damn it. God, I'm not a contrarian. Fuck me. I don't love it much. I'm exposed. Oops, uh-oh. Well, in a very unfortunate and unexpected twist, it appears we are in the land of chickens that are indeed the size of zombies. That's right, Adrian. And it looks like we're just gonna have to wing it. Wings. <laughs> Chicken wings, you know. You're fired, Mavia. You're fired. Is that it? Okay, epic. Alright, well, there you go. That's Minecraft story mode. What a fucking... What, um... Not bad. <laughs> oh, Christ.